Fanatics, an NFL shop in particular, it really failed me. And it's failed a lot of other people, too. I, uh, I ordered this one hat. Uh, and shirt. It was like a Kelly Green one. It's the first Kelly Green one I've ever owned. I've never owned a Kelly Green hat. And I've been looking at it, and I was like, this is a really cool hat, and I want to buy it. I don't I don't really ever buy Eagles merchandise that much. Like, the what I'm wearing right now is from, like, 2017, 2018, right? So I don't really buy a lot of that stuff. And I was – they let me down at Fanatics because I buy this hat. Which, first of all, it was like sold out for like two weeks. And then I see it on social media and I'm like, okay, I'm going to buy it now. The hat was like $34 or something like that. And I bought a shirt with it, like a Kelly Green shirt. And it said that it was going to arrive September 11th. So like the day after the first game. And I was like, fine, whatever. And then September uh, 11th comes around, and I'm like, well, it still says it's on in route, right? And I'm like, I'm never getting this hat. I look on the, the UPS tracking website, and the UPS tracking website is like, uh, oh, it's on its way. And it, it, it went from wherever the headquarters was, which is on the East Coast, I think, uh, all the way to the state where I live in. And it got there on the 5th. And I'm like, dude, there's no way I'm going to get this thing. It's lost. So I wait about six days. And it still keeps saying the same thing after 7 p.m. It's like, all right, it's going to come the next day at 7 p.m. And um, it, it just never shows up. And I'm super confused about it, super upset about it, because I really wanted this thing. I call NFL shop, and they're like, well, yeah, it's probably lost. And I was like, no, you you sure about that? Like, you think? <laughs> you sure about that? Yeah, of course it's lost. You know, I, 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 I bought it like, like 25 days ago. And it still hasn't arrived. So uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I think it's fair to say that it's lost. And what added insult to injury about that was the fact that it was sold out. Because we're talking about Eagles fans here. Like When the whole Kelly Green stuff came out, Eagles fans just went gaga over it. And they, they wanted everything to do with it. Because um, I got a, a Philadelphia Eagles jersey. And I got... Obviously, the shirt, they were like, do you want us to cancel the shirt too? And I was like, no, I'll just take the shirt because it's whatever. And for about a month, I was like going on the NFL shop website. It's still sold out. I have zero confidence that it's going to come back. A lot of it, the, the, the Kelly Green Eagles merchandise, it was out. It was it was completely out of um, out of commission. Like within a few days, like something was going to be sold out. So I, you know, I kind of thought to myself, hey, uh, why don't I go on eBay? So I go on eBay, and eBay is like, it's got a lot of stuff. And I, I knew that I could see like it, through 40 pages that, uh, you know, a lot of the stuff that people were selling were like product, like sideline hats that were, uh, that were like put on sale very recently, like on the NFL website. And I was like, well, maybe I could find it here. I couldn't find it. I, I look at the NFL website a lot, and I, I talk like I get the the advertisements on on NFL Shop a lot, and you know I, I know what is something new, and I know um, some I know a lot of something that is old, um, and I kind of found that oh you know this is a newer uh, product, but they weren't selling the hat that I wanted, and you know not it's not the one that I'm wearing right now. But I end up, I end up seeing um, that specific uh, hat after having the bright idea of searching it on Google. I searched the hat on Google. I searched the, all the specs of the hat on Google. And it basically comes up, and I'm like, dude, this has got to be a trick. Like, 
they got to be like Joss. This has got to be like something fake. And it's Rally House. And I, I have a Rally House near my house. It doesn't sell Eagles merchandise because I don't, that's not the area that I live in. But it, I go to the website and, and it's there. And I'm just thinking to myself, like, okay, I gotta buy this thing right now. Like, usually whenever I buy something, I always ask my wife. Not because she ever says, like, no, but, like, I think it has a lot to do with, like, my upbringing. Like, I didn't really ask for a lot of things as a kid. And, like, whenever I did, uh, you know, get it, I would always ask for it. So it's, like, kind of puts her in, like, the parenting situation. But I, I'm basically just, like, all right, I'm gonna buy this hat because... I've been looking for this hat for a long time. And I buy the hat and I'm like, cha-ching, Rally House, thank you. Um, the only problem with Rally House, and look, I don't work for Rally House, Rally House doesn't pay me to do these plugs, but um, the only problem with Rally House is the fact that it is expensive. It is, it is kind of expensive to buy from Rally House um, they've got they've got all the same products like the you know I kind of live in the south I kind of live in Big Twelve territory so it's really good for college and it's really good for baseball and football. The prices are high, so people were like, "Oh, you know, the prices are high, bad customer service and stuff like that." And I was like, "Oh, I don't know," because the hat was like thirty four dollars, but I bought it for like fifty. But it's probably because it's like a secondary seller. And uh, well, long story short. I got the hat, and the hat looks pretty good. I think that next week when the Eagles play the Dolphins, I'm just going to Kelly Green out. Like, I don't even really care. Like, I always put on, like, a specific uniform whenever the Eagles play, um, a, like, a home uniform and away uniform. Um, this is, like, my away one, but obviously it didn't really work out very well. So, you know, I'm just going to have fun with it, and, and, you know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, but... Uh, this isn't a plug for Rally House, but if you if it, they have all of the merchandise on it, they have all the merchandise from like Lids and you know NFL Shop, Fanatics, they have all that stuff on there. And I'm honestly gonna use them more now. I, I'm I don't think I'll ever buy from NFL Shop again. I don't think I'll ever buy from Fanatics again. Um, I'll bite the bullet on like buying products for fifteen extra dollars just because I know that I'm going to get it. I know that I'm going to get the product. And look, dude, I got my hat in less than a week. That's impressive. And I want to like formally thank Rally House for like not losing it. Um they made sure to contact me like every stretch of the way. They didn't forget about me. So that's the kind of customer service that I like. When, huh, when I, when they lost the original hat, when NFL Shop and UPS, whatever, I, I don't even know who lost it. They, the, the worst part was the fact that on September 16th, they sent me a, an email being like, so how do you like your merchandise? My response to that was like, yeah, I, I'm really enjoying these. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the, the update. I'm really enjoying it because I didn't get what I, what I ordered. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not one of those super like super impatient people who's like, oh, you know, I didn't get my product. I'm gonna carry it out. No, dude, I waited for tw almost 25 days, and I didn't get anything. I didn't get anything. It wasn't until like September 20th until I actually started. I made the phone call to cancel the hat order and get a new shirt. So, lesson learned. I'm never buying from uh, from uh, the, a Fanatics website or an NFL shop website again. I am biting $15 extra, and I'm buying from Rally House. That's what I'm doing.